Have you ever wondered why identical twins who have the exact same DNA grow up to have different looks or get different diseases? Well, the answer lies in epigenetics. So what is epigenetics? Epi means above. So it means above genome. To understand this, you need to think of your DNA as a piano itself with over 20,000 keys. And epigenetics is a pianist and the sheet music, deciding which keys are pressed and which are muted. Epigenetics works through three main modifications. Think of DNA methylation as placing a mute on a piano key. It adds methyl group to DNA, preventing transcription, just like a light switch being turned on and off. Second, histone modification. Histone acetylation is like adjusting tension on a piano string. It adds acetyl group which loosens the genes, allowing them to be easily transcribed. But removing them does the opposite. But histone methylation works in a complex manner sometimes preventing transcription and sometimes activating it. On the other hand, non-coding RNAs act as section conductors. They bind to mRNA and prevent them from being translated into protein. They also recruit the other two modifiers to create a unique harmonious gene expression. Our unique experiences, trauma, and environment affect this modifier, activating some helpful genes and sometimes harmful ones. This is why identical twins who had different experiences and environment grow up differently. Epigenetics also explains the causes of cancer, mental illness, and many more. Today, scientists are leveraging these ideas to develop epigenetic therapies, drugs, and many more that can be used to rewrite these faulty instructions. But for you, just relax, eat healthy, and stay fit. This is the foundation of your development. The choice is yours. So will you play the keys to your fitness or not?